Hey guys, um, welcome to my channel. I am Simmer Shy Mommy. For those of you who do not know, for those of you who do, hello and welcome back. Now, what I have here is um my sim self, and she's she's looking shocked. Once upon a time, we were on a lovely cruise ship five star quality room service spas Olympic sized swimming pools and buffets all day long now we are stuck and I am stuck in the middle of nowhere I don't even know what these people are popping up but I will uh, I will take care of all that because as I am about to tell you guys this is the midnight sun challenge yes or else it's called Isles of the Midnight Sun it is basically that I am the only person as soon as I get rid of these random spawning people I'm the only person on this entire island and I have to survive here for five generations um the way you meet other sims is that you can travel three times once as a young adult once as an adult and once as an elder now in this updated version because as you see we have a houseboat and if you've seen some of the other type of uh, Isle of Midnight Sun challenges you'll notice that they were on a different island with no um, houseboats and whatnot um, I just not only did the other this version the newest version because I want to dive lots and uh, things like that now I'm going to keep this pause for the duration of this part simply because I am going to have to figure out a way and if any of you guys use Enros and actually know how to keep these people off the island because I turned off story progression but they're still popping up so I might just have to turn on and make the population just I don't know I don't know but back to this um so yeah, I'm the only person on this whole beautiful island. I don't know why this leg is laggy, laggy. One second. All right, so I'm back, and the leg is over and done with. Now, I am the only person on this island, and I want to change that as soon as possible. So what I'm going to do, since this is the updated version, I'm going to go to university, right? because that's what you can do in the updated version you can go to university instead of traveling however if you do go to university that means you cannot travel at least the founder me could not travel at all I have to stay on this one island for the rest of my life after I graduate okay so all the fun that I'm going to have in my entire lifetime has to be on university and not only am I doing that because I feel like I can make more money in university by you know applying for extra funds and getting a lot of herbs for the garden um, like uh, posing news classes things like that um, so I'm interested in trying this out for size now there are some do's and don'ts that I can and cannot do not a lot of them basically I can't leave this island ever I can't get married. I can't have kids. They must have randomized traits. Um, once you are on this island, you are on for good until the next founder um, or my heir goes to travel to meet his or her mate, which will probably be um, at a different country. Also, you can use Traveler Mod to go to a different world. So I don't just have to go to China, France, or Egypt. I can go to Bridgeport, Aurora Skies, Moonlight Falls, Sunlit Tides, Par Peace Isla Paradiso, 
um, anything like that. Now, I'm not sure about the getting gifts thing. I'm not sure. So, I, uh, I kind of want to figure that out. But, that's about it. So, what I'm going to do, right flipping now, I was having her fish sell those bad boys. Um, right flipping now is, that was just the mascot, is enroll the university right now because um, I gotta get away from this town. All these spawny Sparnertons. Oh, that's her um, lifetime wish, by the way. I will let you, um, I'm trying to see, I'm gonna say me because this is my sim self. I have to get in the habit of doing that. Oh yeah, I hope this music isn't too loud, so I'm gonna move quickly. I do have a mod in that allows me to get a degree in for one week or well, one term, one semester. <laughs> um, let's see, fine arts. And Fraps is just doing this thing again. One second, guys. All right, guys, so I'm off to university through the water or whatever and I'm just gonna tell you um, why I'm also like choosing to go there because that's her lifetime wish to be the perfect student and graduate with the perfect GPA all right so I I, can't, I said her again right I am just gonna talk to you while this is loading while as long as it doesn't um, as long as the music doesn't get too loud I am a natural cook I am artistic I am family oriented. Also, I am a, did I say net? Yeah, I said natural cook, artistic, family oriented, a green thumb, and something else. I feel like I put diva or dramatic or something. I don't know, something crazy. But, um, yes, I'm all those things, and I am a Taurus, so be prepared for that. But that's about it. Those are the rules and whatnot. I'm probably going to close this down and let it load up a little bit faster, and then I'll hit you guys up once we get to university, and I'll let you know where I'll be staying at and all that. Alrighty okay. then. Hey, guys. And all right, here we are. At the dorm, and um, I don't know what that really means because they're normal now. So we're at the dorm, and um, I selected Shy's room already. So, excuse me, I'm gonna let her get settled in, and I'm also gonna start by picking up all the free stuff on this campus. Yes, yes, I am. Oh my gosh, this lag is crazy. Last time I had some lag like this, I had like a sims 2 mod or something in my game but i'm gonna have to figure that out definitely now i will show you guys her room um i'm so glad this is the first episode <laughs> because it's like it's crazy um her room is on the top floor and i took this room right here I didn't change much because you know it's coming out of our money, but I did get a double bed that way when I meet my Mr. Right, who may be here right now, let's take a look, um, then I will have no problems, you know, seducing him and getting him right where I want him. <laughs> um, almost, almost Jacob Solomon, almost, but not quite. I'll keep you on retainer though, just in case I need you. All right, now stop playing kicky bag and what am I going to have you do? Something that can make us some money. You know what? I might just look at the job board. That's a quick way to get us around and I'm gonna accept gifts. You know what? I'm gonna do that off camera. Check the job for social jobs. Oh, no, 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 because they'll give you points. Um, sorry. Check the job board for day jobs. I need some moolah, sweetheart, and I really don't care what they're talking about. 
at all, all, all. Okay, what happened? Check the job or for day jobs. Like, are there no jobs available yet? Oh. I'm not sure what this means. Are there social group jobs? No. Okay, well, I'm going to chalk it up to us just getting here. And that's why there are no jobs. However, what can I do right now to make some money? Like, that is basically all I'm concerned with. Like, that's it. That's exactly why I chose to come here. Matter of fact, what I can do is go down to the grotto. And, um, or somewhere along here. And start gathering these plants. Yep, yep, yep. Actually, she can come dumpster dive too. Dumpster dive. And then harvest everything you can. Oh my goodness gracious, this lag. Okay, well, while I try to figure out what this lag is resulting from, I'm going to end this episode right here. Just because it's just the beginning, just to let you guys know something new that... It's periodically going to be on my channel because once again I do not know if I'm going to be doing this every day. Well I know I'm not going to be posting this up every day as a start. But just to let you know in the order of which this is going to go and um, how I'm going to get this challenge started. That's all this first episode was really about. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Like, rate, subscribe do all of that good stuff and i love you guys just forever um so that's about it as i say and i always will happy sending and have a very summerific day bye guys <laughs>